Hello students, welcome to my channel Incredible Fitness Question. I am Dr. Komal and we are continuing with the part 3 of Ascending Tracts. So today we are going to see Spinocerebellar Tracts. Now these tracts they have role in regulation of posture, muscle tone and coordinated skill movements. If destruction of these tracts occur, there leads to sensory ataxia. So this is the diagram which depicts whole of the Spinocerebellar Tract. So let's begin with the course of the tract. As you can see, this is first order of neuron which is present in dorsal root ganglion. From here, the fibers enter the spinal cord where they synapse with the Clarkis column and they bend laterally. This tract here forms the second order of neuron. Now, from here, it occupies lateral and dorsal aspect of the spinal cord. It ascends upwards. The tract is known as Felschix tract or the dorsal spinocerebellar tract as you can see here. Now this tract it remains on the same side. It reaches the medulla on the same side. Thus it has only uncrossed fibers. These fibers they ascend upwards and reach the inferior cerebellar peduncle as shown in the diagram. And from here, the third order of neuron begins and this third order of neuron, this is the third order of neuron, it's beginning from here, it reaches the cerebral cortex. So this is how the dorsal quorum tract is depicted. So now this is the ventral spinocerebellar tract. As you can see the first order of neuron started from dorsal root ganglion. It has both crossed and uncrossed fibers. The crossed one they ascend upwards and reach the superior cerebellar peduncle. This is known as a ventral or bovers tract. So the second order is in spinal cord only. So this is second order. These are the crossed fibers. Gover's tract, it reaches upwards till the superior cerebral peduncle and the worm is where the third order of neuron begins and then it reaches the cerebral cortex. So this is how both the tracts, they ascend upwards, dorsal having the uncrossed fibers while ventral both crossed and uncrossed fibers. These are the functions. Thanks students for watching my channel. If you have any queries, do comment here. For more such lectures, thank you.